Hey y'all, this is Tina. Welcome to my channel. Okay, I am back because, well, number one, I'm super excited. I went and stopped and checked my mailbox this afternoon and I had happy mail. This comes from Dana Kunsteller. I hope I said your name right and I do apologize if I did not. D-A-Y-N-A, -A, Dana, I'm thinking. Okay, so if I've said it wrong, I do apologize. Um, but yeah, I was so excited when I got this. I did not really expect anything in my box, but I thought, well, since it's over close to my work, I'll stop by and check. So I opened up the end, but I have not opened up what is inside. So it's pretty exciting. Okay, so it says, Dina, thank you so much for hoping, hosting the swap. Here is a little something to thank you. And y'all look how she put in some brown paper. I love that. I love that so much. Let's just dig in. Super exciting. Super exciting. Exciting, exciting. Okay. And she made me a beautiful loaded envelope. Oh my goodness. I love it so much. How gorgeous is this, y'all? Thank you so much. Oh my goodness, Dana. If I'm saying your name wrong, I'm so sorry. But thank you so much. I really do appreciate this. I love this look. She made a beautiful rosette. Just gorgeous, y'all. Look. Isn't that so pretty? And look. It's a magnet. Look, y'all. How creative is she? Beautiful, beautiful. Oh my goodness. Oh my. Look, another magnet. This one says pumpkins. Beautiful. Oh my goodness. I'm just amazed. She gave me some little clothes pins. Look at the top, y'all. Uh, some sequin mix or some little sequins mix. I love it. Look, oh, I love that so much. Oh, okay, let's see what we got in this one. Look how she wrapped it in the twine. So creative, just beautiful, just beautiful. Y'all, my group is so full of the most wonderful crafty people. Oh my goodness. Look at that. She sent me rosettes and these, I bet these are made out of, out of uh, cupcake liners. Absolutely gorgeous. And the colors are just beautiful, beautiful. Look at the other side. Look at that. You put it out. It's like a fan almost. Look. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm so excited. Now look at this. That is just gorgeous. Some little, some little cut aparts here. Oh, heaven give you many, many merry days. Oh, thank you, thank you. I love these so much. Now I think that she stamped these, y'all. Beautiful. I'm thinking that she stamped these. This is what they kind of look like. Just absolutely gorgeous. I love these so much. Look, look, and we've got one more here. Look, so pretty, so, so pretty. She gave me some buttons. I like that. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Look, how beautiful is this? It looks like she stamped more. This one says the most beautiful stones have been tossed by the wind and washed by the waters and polished to brilliance by life's strongest storms. How beautiful. I think she stamped these and they are just absolutely gorgeous. And this is just too cute. I love the colors. It's so pretty. And look, oh, she sent me some thin lids. Oh, thank you so much. Look, she sent me some bling. Oh my goodness, three blings. Oh, I love it so much. Oh my goodness, I am so amazed by your generosity and your kindness. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. 
Okay, so let me get this one open. And, okay. Oh, we got some, some cute stuff in here. Okay, look y'all, this one's a magnet. Look, and she gave me the, these really super beautiful paper clips. Oh my goodness. Some owl stickers. I love those. I love it so much. And it's so in the color combination, y'all. Look how beautiful. And look how pretty. Look, it's like a little mini album. I love this so much. Amazing. Okay, Miss Dana. I love this so much. Look at the paper she used inside. Isn't that just gorgeous? Look, it's got pies on it. There's the back. It's beautiful. Thank you so much. I am absolutely amazed. I am blown away. I am excited. I am very grateful. Thank you so much. And you know what? It was such a pleasure to, to host the swap. And it was my first time. And it all has worked out just fine. So, you know, I was a little worried at first, but... It has all worked out and everybody is so happy. And uh, yeah, we're gonna be doing, a, if, you, if you've looked at my other videos, what I'm gonna be doing, we're gonna do another swap. It's gonna be starting in the middle of November and we're gonna be doing a Christmas card swap. Handmade Christmas card swap. So that's gonna be real fun. And it be, can be any kind of card you wanna make. It could be a stand-up card, a sit-down card, an open and close card, any kind of card. Any kind of card you want, it could be. So anyway, um, yeah, thank you. Thank you, thank you, Miss Dana. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. I appreciate it. These are just gorgeous. And yes, I'm grateful. Thank you. Thank you very much. This makes me wanna cry. Oh my goodness. This is so gorgeous. I so appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, so I'm gonna not be sappy. I'm gonna move on. But this, I just can't get over it. I'm gonna stick this all back in here for now. Can't get over that. And let me put this cute paper clip up here. Okay, so also too, this afternoon, I got off work early because I had to go to the doctor's appointment just for a routine checkup or whatever. And so I stopped off at Michael's and so I just wanted to share a few things that I did pick up. These were $7, they weren't on sale, but I did use a 40% off coupon on this. And it gives me lots of different reds. You know, Christmas is coming. And so I've ran out of my red um, ribbons. So I think I'm going to buy a couple more of these. So I'm just going to kind of probably try to watch to see if it go on sale. Then I can use a coupon. But I wanted to go ahead and get this one. I really liked this one. So I grabbed that. And I have a project that I'm going to be doing. And so I bought some liquid stitch. You'll see what I'm going to use with this soon. I found these these two packs of tags. Look, they were $5 a piece. They weren't on the hot buy section. But look how cute they are, y'all. Y'all, they're so cute. This one right here, I'm going to make something out of this. Because it's got little pockets on all of them. And it looks like I can make an advent calendar out of it. So that is pretty exciting. And I just couldn't pass that up. How cute is that? That is so cute. Okay. So then I picked up, of course, a couple pads of paper. I hadn't seen this one at my Michaels, so I picked this one up. I'm just going to kind of flip through. Looks like 14 um, pieces, 14 colors. Actually, let me see if I can get this all opened up. Looks like 14 uh, different kinds of pictures in here or patterns on the paper. And let's just see. 48 sheets, so it looks like maybe four of each one, maybe. Beautiful. Love it so traditional. How lovely. Could make some great cards with this. Don't y'all love this? How cute is that? So beautiful. Sorry if I was out of frame there, y'all. And y'all look, it's trees. And amazing. Absolutely gorgeous. Now everybody is sharing their new hot buy pads with with, uh, with you on their channel, so I don't know if you've seen this one, so I won't take it too long. Now, I've seen this one in one of my other pads before. It looks like a sweater. 
some of some of this beautiful plaid. And look, gorgeous. This is gonna be great because I stopped off um, also on my way home. Um, I'm trying to buy new tables for my craft fair because I've always borrowed my daughter's. So I picked up one and I'm gonna go pick up another one. I could only carry one in my buggy, but I bought the six foot tables that fold in half so it's easier to store. And they have them at Costco and they were $52. So that wasn't too bad, I didn't think. And um, I went ahead and I picked up um, two boxes of the hot cocoa so I could work on my hot cocoa packs tonight. And uh, their hot cocoa, I think it comes 60 in a pack. It's Swiss Miss brand. And it was $5 and I think 69 cents or 89 cents, somewhere around there. It was less than six bucks. So it was a great deal. So I'm gonna work on that. I've got a lot of things I'm gonna do this weekend to try to wipe some stuff out. I'm gonna stay focused, gotta stay focused. But until, but before then I need to look at this beautiful paper. Y'all, I'm nuts. I love paper, I'm a paper collector, not a paper hoarder. Now isn't this gorgeous? Gold, shiny Christmas trees. And this is absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Love it. It's, this is such a traditional type um, paper pad. I love it. And look, looks like a table. I love that. Okay, so I got that one. I have seen this one shared on other channels. Um, actually, I'm not going to say other channels. I'm just going to say one channel. Um, I know that Crafty Creations, Nadine over there, she had this one. And this one has finally now came to my Michaels. So I just, I thought I really like this one too. I love the, I love the colors. So yeah, it's pretty exciting. So I grabbed one of these and I'm just going to flip through this one really fast. This one's called Holiday Bash. The other one was called Christmas Cabin. Okay, this is Holiday Bash. Love it, love it, love it. Look y'all. Oh my goodness, just gorgeous. I just don't know which one to use. There's so much great paper. I'm so excited. Sorry, y'all. I just can't help it. This beautiful paper makes me so excited. And if you're a crafter, you get excited too. Love it, love it, love it. Gorgeous. Okay, it looks like I'm flipping over two pages at a time that are the same. Some unicorns and some uh, mermaids. This one's so cute. I'll definitely be using this for hot cocoa packs because look, it's got little cups of hot cocoa or cappuccinos on it. Love it. These will make some great Christmas cards. In fact, I started making some Christmas cards the other night. So these cut kind of parts make great Christmas cards. How cute. Beautiful, darling. Don't know what else to say. It's just so exciting. I love that. Look at him. My sister Denise, she loves little snowmen's like that too. Look, these little, oh, these might be sloths. Is that a sloth? Kind of looks like it. I don't know. I think it might be. How cute. Love it. Love it. Love it. Beautiful. Oh my goodness. So pretty. Okay, now I have seen this one um, before on Nadine's channel as well when she first got her paper. Because her Michaels must have just got a whole bunch of paper. So, um, yeah, it was pretty it's pretty exciting. This one is called Stay Freeze. So, if you haven't seen this one, that, that's, that's what this one is called. They are on 70% off, and I used the 20% off coupon from the from my Joann's app on my phone. So, it gave me, I think they come up like $4 and something a piece. So pretty, and these are, looks like, more traditional. I love these, y'all. So exciting. Do y'all get as excited about paper as I do? Leave me a comment below, because this is so exciting. It's just beautiful. Every year, they come out with better and better prints. And, yeah. Oh, my goodness. It looks like a hot cocoa one for me. I'm going to have to pull some paper out of all these different ones and make some more hot cocoa sleeves for the hot cocoa packs. Love it. Just beautiful, y'all. And this one isn't that darling. So sweet. Yeah, let me comment below if you get this excited because let me tell you, I'm just so excited. Just so excited. 
to have beautiful little things. And y'all, it's not like I needed this paper. I just love it. It's a want, not a need, you know. Oh, well. Beautiful. Okay, I really love this one. Ooh. I love this one a lot. Okay. And I know I flipped through fast. But I didn't want to make this last too long for you. And y'all will just sit here and listen to me ooh and and on. Oh my goodness. I'm so sorry, y'all. Okay. So, and then the last one that I got was the North Pole Gazette. I already had one of these. But I love this one so much that I had to get another one. I just was so afraid. Well, what if they sell out? And I love this one. Actually, I love this one more than the pink one. I do. I just think it's just the most gorgeous paper and um, yeah, it's pretty exciting. And I'm gonna use some of these cut aparts and I am gonna cut them up. And I'm making handmade Christmas cards. I might make some like Christmas card packs to put in the craft fair. It, Cause I already started, I did a couple the other night. And um, yeah, so I thought, you know, that's what I'm gonna do. I don't, I'm not gonna let these cut aparts just sit there. I'm gonna really use them up. So that's my goal. I've got so many goals for the weekend and I hope I can accompl accomplish some of them. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to try to finish up making up all my bowl koozies. I still have about 15 or 20 to make. I'm going to try to see how many I can get going this weekend. And yeah, I've got, um, I worked on last night my hand warmers that have the rice inside. I did go to 100% fabric and I think I got 10 made. So that makes, that makes five packs because I'm going to make them as a set. Um, I'm going to put two together and I think I'll do those for like $5 or six. I have to just kind of sit there and wait how much I'm going to do them for. Let me comment below what you think on the, on the hand warmers that I'm going to make. Um, I did do a video before and I had used fleece and then, and then, I, um, a lot of people said, you know, you might want to go to hundred percent cotton so it's more safe. And I didn't have a problem with the fleece. It was working fine in my microwave, but I wouldn't want to sell it to someone else and them have a problem. So I went to, I found some same black and red plaid at Walmart fabric. And I cut them up and used my pinking shears and voila, sewed them up. All I've got to do is the ones I made, I've got to get them bunched together, put some twine on them, and um, put a cute tag and call it a day. So, y'all, I hope that you enjoyed this. And I hope that you enjoyed my paper share. But I hope that you really, really enjoyed this. Because she just is such a beautiful work. And everything, the attention to detail, the, the time that she took to make this for me is just, I'm just amazed and very grateful. So Miss Dana, and I pray I say your name right. If you are watching, thank you from the bottom of my heart. I really appreciate it. Okay, y'all, this is going to be it for me for right now. Hope you've enjoyed this. I'll jump on this. I'll jump on tomorrow and let you know what I'm working on and see what I can share with you. But yeah, I've got a lot of things I'm going to do this weekend as far as my craft room. And my husband came in my craft room last night and said, you need to clean your room. Yeah, it's pretty bad right now. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to try to hit that too. I don't know how I'm going to fit it all in, but you know what? I'm going to stay home and I'm just going to do it. That's so I'm just going to do it. It's going to gonna do it. Try to put some, maybe the Halloween stuff away. Cause I'm kind of, kind of like over Halloween already. I'm just loving the fall stuff now. And yeah, after thing, after a Halloween next week, it's all full fledged, um, Christmas, maybe a little fall and Thanksgiving, but mainly Christmas. Anyway, I hope that you've enjoyed this. Thank you again, Miss Dana. Appreciate it so much. And uh, y'all, thanks for watching. Bye.